yeah i forgot to listen to music before this i usually i pump myself up with music and I'm you're gonna be low energy in silence yeah i'm unwell sorry apologies to you and apologies to the viewer uh your boy is a little unwell today it's a tummy issue what's wrong you with you you're always getting sick right <laughs> no i'm not i'm not always getting sick i've been i've had a good stretch of not being sick um, i get like sick once a year uh well, so i guess I th- you, you just made a tough stuff i guess you, you need it you need to check yourself are you are you <laughs> getting amongst like uh, illnesses are you putting yourself at risk i never wash my hands with soap uh okay that might be it <laughs> that could be it uh i ate chicken wings today that were potentially undercooked uh and i haven't had hot sauce in a long time and mm. i found there's a deli near me that sells my favorite hot sauce tapatio uh so yeah your boy put some hot sauce on some undercooked wings uh and whatever yep. the first thing i said i don't usually wash my hands with soap so and i ate with my hands so i'm yeah, thinking three issues there that's the three ish right there i'm not like you know i'm not doing a bed i'm not pointing fingers saying it's everybody's fault you know i'm just yeah. i'm unwell you know yeah i think yeah. um probably the undercooked chicken that's probably oh that's number one that's probably it yeah. really like okay, whenever I'm anyone scented. ever tells me that they've got food poisoning, it's always undercooked chicken. Yeah, and chicken is just like my favorite food as well. Like it's my it's by far my favorite meat. I oh, love. Oh oh yeah. Back back in the day when I was a, a meaty boy, just getting mm-hmm. a barbecued chicken and just like tearing that shit apart with your fingers. Dude, I'm roasting my own chooks these days. It's so fucking good. <laughs> <You're> roasting your <laughs> own chooks. Yeah. Oh, in the oven. So good. Yeah, in the oven. It's so good. Yeah. Um, you can roast a, chook- a chicken in the time it takes to watch an NRL game, which is what I did while watching ah. the Titans game over the weekend. I cooked a roast chicken. It's easy. Yes, you need a little bit of a treat after that game. And <laughs> let's not talk about. Let's not talk about yeah. the Titans finals hopes. We we well, um, I mean the the NRLW season is is about to start, and those yes. are some Titans we can get behind. <laughs> yes, yes, finally. Um, yeah. When does that start? That starts soon. They're in the it's team this list. weekend. I think Friday. I'm gonna have to look at that draw. Hey, let's have a look. Yeah, oh, I or did might, be, look. might be Thursday. Might be Thursday actually. Prem women's prem. Yeah, Thursday. Mm. Oh, don't tell Ben. I just I don't feel like I can be fucked with the W season. You know. <laughs> don't like... tell. Don't tell him. He's not gonna watch this. <laughs> yeah. I just yeah. I can't be fucked. I'm almost NRL'd out as it is. Mm. Uh, which reminds me. We're almost there, dude. Like, where are we right now? Are we going through the dead marshes right now? To use that metaphor from last oh, year. <laughs> we, we might be going up the, the it, endless stairs or whatever they're called. Oh, yeah, into Shelob's Lair. I feel like, yeah, Mordor is the final series, yeah. right? <laughs> so we're going up the stairs. <laughs> yeah, we're going up the stairs. We're, we're at, like, the last five weeks, four weeks of the regular season, that Shelob's Lair. Yeah, and Ben's sprinkled a little bit of um, Lemba spread on me while I sleep. Oh yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Could have contributed to the food poisoning, you yeah. never know. Go home, Mike. <laughs> Go home. <laughs> and even though I'm sick, whisk. Yeah, good. You need it. This is medicine. Make me feel better. Um Do we think he's gonna he's gonna show up, right? He'll show up. You didn't put the link in the thing. I did, did put you? the link in the thing. Um yeah. I guess if he really wants to get in, he'll let us know. He'll figure it out. And I'll give him the link. <laughs> yeah uh how was your weekend dude what'd you do you went uh, hiking yeah we went hiking together yeah not that just the fun. two of us with a group yeah with a gr- no okay, if it was that. just me and you that'd be <laughs> that'd be pretty cute yeah pretty cute. i mean we could do it unless yeah no it was um <laughs> it was it was a good weekend yeah i did a bit of that and then oh, i feel like i played um dungeons and dragons i played uh pokemon tabletop oh yeah yeah on the sunday and then hung out with my gal you know wish gal mm-hmm. uh, what about yourself um yep went for a hike uh what did i do sunday i put together a flat pack outdoor furniture set uh which tested my patience but i'm sort of good at that sort of thing because it's like lego and it tickles that little autism in me Mm. you know like i'm like "Mm, yes i love following the steps and seeing the complete product i love that Mm -hmm. Uh, and i uh well, that was sunday and i watched the footy and just wrote myself off basically and i've got this entire week off of work saw your stepbrother yesterday oh that's uh, nice yeah we brought uh you came up in conversation and he was like oh, i gotta message that guy back he did um 
ran into the great queef or didn't run into him planned a lunch with the great queef the queef uh today i put together more flat back furniture and yeah here i am unwell on a just a tip tipping show well thank you for being here yeah yeah thank you and thank you guests thank you for joining us for another episode of just a tip i'm your host mike Join me as always, Matt. It feels weird doing this without the music, but I can sort of hear the music in my head. It's know, there. And the logo. There it goes. Yeah, that's beautiful. Yeah. And um, slow news week in NRL this week. And Ben's not here, so we can just get straight into NRL. It's great. Wait, wait. Before we get there, I do have something yeah. I want to talk about. What is it? Go. So, um, are you familiar with uh, one um, talking, talented mouse, Stuart Little? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you, you ever watch the Stuart Little movies? I mean, when I watched the Stuart Little movie when it came out. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So what we've got here is a is a mouse, right? Uh-huh. Who was adopted. Yeah. Uh, a magical mouse who could talk and who could wear clothes. And he got adopted mm-hmm. by a family. Mm-hmm. I, I, again, it hasn't been a long time since I've seen it, but it came and it popped into my head today. So mm-hmm. if Kurt remember wrong, he was a mouse and he lived in an orphanage. Yes. And he, he was adopted because... He's a mouse. No one else is going to adopt him, right? I mean, I guess so, yeah. Is that the I mean, reasoning? He's lucky not to get poisoned in the orphanage. You know, it feels yeah. like it's kind of a health and safety thing. So they adopt him, right? Because um, yeah. what I'm, I'm thinking about Stuart Little yeah. is like, um, sure, he has the movie where he's like settling into life at home and he's got his like human brother there who's like mm-hmm. a little bit off him at first, but at the end they're best buds and he helps him win the big boat race. Right, okay. I don't the remember boat race. the boat race, but yeah, okay. They they they've got like this big um, boat race, like a remote control boat race to do on the pond, okay. and um, the little kid does it with his dad, and uh, the remote control boat breaks down or something, or the remote can stops working, and Stuart mm-hmm. Little, the mouse, mm-hmm. has yeah. to pilot the boat ro- the boat manually. He's on okay. the. He's and on he, the, and he, yeah, okay, and he wins and the he race. Re- I think wins the race, beats like okay. the evil fritch kid who has like a, like a super boat. Okay, um, who, who probably sabotaged their boat. Uh, probably. I reckon the little blades come out the side like in Greece. Um, yeah. so, <laughs> that's, a, and, uh, that's a movie I want to talk about, Greece. But sorry, we're on Stuart Little. We'll, we'll get to that. <laughs> um, Stuart Little 2, I don't remember much of it. All I remember is that there is a peregrine falcon in yeah. New York City just uh-huh. made a nest uh-huh. Um and uh, Stuart Little is like trying to like drive his little car around the streets and the Peregrine <laughs> Falcon's like swooping him. You know what I mean? Okay. Yeah. Um, I I feel like I feel like we need more Stuart Little movies. Like a third one? Was there Stuart Little three? I don't know if there was, but there if there's not, that's a crime. I feel like everyone gets obsessed with like the Harry Potter saga, the Lord of the Rings series. Okay. What about the Stuart Little? More... What about the Stuart Little, Little side? <laughs> I don't. I don't think I can sign off on the more Stuart Little movies. Sorry. Uh, it looks like Stuart Little, Stuart Little Three: Call of the Wild was a fully animated movie. <laughs> oh, fully animated. <laughs> so it doesn't count. It's not canon. Yeah. Oh, what is this Stuart Little Big Photo Adventure? That Big might be a video adventure? game. That, that might be a video like, game. Yeah. That sounds like a video game. And uh, what is it? It's got four out of ten. Stuart Little: Call of the Wild. Um. Yeah, no, I thought you were going to go down the route of how fucked up it is that, you know, these parents could have taken home a human child, but instead they took home vermin. You know? Yeah, I understand that. But he's and basically sh- a human. Like he's. It's probably he's a metaphor for something, right? It's probably a metaphor for something. I Well, they adopted him because no one else is going to take cute little Stuart Little. Yeah. So I could see that. But you bring him into your house and then, like, he's so easily squashable he's so fragile <laughs> yes. um you'd think he would just get accidentally squashed on in the house yeah you, you'd think so you think he'd like eat something off the floor that was he was not meant to eat and die potentially yeah. like the um the health insurance for him would be astronomical <laughs> wonder if they had to pay more or less in paperwork at the at the orphanage and if his paperwork mm. is human-sized even or is it mouse-sized <laughs> well <laughs> I imagine the paperwork, it might be like A2, that's smaller yeah. than A4. Uh, no, A5. Yeah. A5, that's because A3 be. is bigger. Yeah, maybe an A5 piece of paper. Um, yeah, you'd think less paperwork because I think they wanted to get rid of this mouse, right? Yeah. Um, I feel like a, having a mouse as a kid, I mean, you'd pay a lot less in food. Oh, for sure. You'd pay a shitload less in food. 
Yeah, uh, but then you'd pay more. And you'd surely got to get health insurance on him. Like, are you going to send him to school? You're going to buy him school uniforms? Does it cost more to get tiny little school uniforms? Imagine if you went up to Bell's, what is it, the Bell's room at Merrimack Bell's, yeah, and was yeah. like, uh, can I get a extra, 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 extra small uh, shirt and pants, please? Yeah. They beat want... you up. Those rough ass women. They're like tuck shop <laughs> ladies, but a level below tuck shop ladies. They're rougher. Yeah, yeah. They're closer yeah. to hell than those women. <laughs> oh, yeah, they're basically God. just people's aunties who have um volunteered. Give yeah, volunteered. Um but yeah, I don't know. Stuart Little man. Let's bring back Stuart Little. I want a Stuart Little three, a real life version. Yeah. No. Uh I and you haven't watched Stuart Little recently. No. I want a Stuart Little cinematic universe. It looks like the um, with his bird friend. It looks like he has a bird friend in the second movie. Um, <laughs> Is it maybe the uh, Peregrine Falcon? Doctor House? No, not the Peregrine Falcon. Different, different character. Different. Uh, Doctor House is the father. Yes. And I want to say Gina Davis is the mother. Mm, Gina Davis. Uh, yeah. Hugh Laurie. That's his name. Hugh Laurie. That's right. Yeah. Nah. Um, cut out all that Stuart Little talk. <laughs> no way no way that's i've been dying to talk about this all day uh well you're lucky it's not a big news week um the only little bit of news that i've got this week is that and i'll get it up here is that john bateman is going back to the uk uh just for the end of this season he's um going to where is it uh, oh yeah michael carianis is reporting that john bateman will join the warrington wolves for the remainder of the season and then mm. return uh, next season to play out the rest of his like he's got like three more years on his contract yeah why just to be with his family maybe couldn't tell you why i guess they've hmm. just got a flurry of edge back rowers uh, I, I i don't know if they do i mean <laughs> Pup, got, uh, ipap is back this week right ipap but he's playing yeah lock they've got finu and ruben porter yeah oh well i mean they must know that it's yeah, over. they're not they're not making finals. It's <laughs> over. Let's just let him go. Uh, John Bateman's a, like, can, can I go home now? And I, yeah. yeah, but only for six months. Yeah, make a run for it next year when Luai comes over. Fuck Luai. Yeah. Luai is going to the Tigers. Yeah, I know. Is Luai going to be able to like change the Tigers? Do you think? What 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 do we think? What our too early prediction on Luai to the Tigers? Um, early prediction is they gain maybe a couple spots in the ladder. They might finish. I'll say. 13th mm -hmm. and Luai will not play state of origin next year you reckon because moses and cleary I, I reckon because his club form will be down because he's playing in a shit team look at what Api happened or api korosau right yeah um he's gonna be playing in a shit team and it's gonna cost him his origin spot you'll have i yeah. cleary moses yeah yeah okay well i still don't hate that for new south wales um Ah, oh, it sucks. He was a hero. He was a hero when we needed him. He was a villain when we didn't need him to be, and now he's a hero. He's so good. That's right. Um, speaking of, Blues beat Queensland. Let's go. Let's go, baby. No doubt. It was, Never in doubt. Let's it was, go. It was a while ago, six days ago, but yeah. I'm still, we're still living it up. Yeah. Oh, dude. I gave myself 48 hours to be an absolute dickhead about it to people. Uh, now that's done. It's over. But I'm still in very fairness, happy about Mike, it. In fairness, Mike... When we were on that nature walk, we were still <laughs> that 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 forty eight hours turned into a whatever <laughs> twice that is ninety six hours. <laughs> little boots in. I was putting little boots in. You know, yeah. where uh, I can't remember what movie it is. It might be the Wild Wild West, where he has like the boot knife, where he yeah. like stabs his hand, the knife comes out. Go, yeah, yeah, boot knife. <laughs> little boot yeah. knife. Uh, yeah. We, you, I, and Axel, who is a stalwart Queenslander, I thought. Uh, tipped the Blues. Um, congratulations to Axel on his perfect round. Spoilers, but mm. um, we were all on the Raiders, more or less. Uh, Raiders getting done in the last second, right? Mm, right. They held from on from memory. They held, held on. on. Yeah, Chanel Harris Tavita is banned from goal kicking. I think probably he missed yeah. one. He missed missed a few. Sucks to be him. Yeah. Uh, uh, we were all on the Bun Buns. Pretty sure the Bun Buns won one, right? On, yes, they I'll beat get it up the, in front of me. Uh, yeah. Tigers. Tigers, yeah. Uh, we were all on the Bronx, uh, except Cindy and Jeff. Fuck them. Uh, here's where we all diverge a little bit. Uh, did you take the Storm? No, you took the Roosters. Damn. I took the Roosters. So did Benjamin. Um, 
yeah, Purple Boys get it done. Mm. Um, fuck them. They're going to win. They're probably going to win the whole comp, Purple Boys. Mm. I said they suck. would. Yeah, awful. Uh, next game, we all had the pants except Benjamin and Jeff. There was a little bit of stern shenanigans, I think. Uh, they would have been absolutely spewing and cursing Nathan Cleary's name. The mm-hmm. Iceman. Did you watch that one? Did you happen to get a get a look at that one? No, I was deep in the uh, the tabletop, but I caught the highlights. Yeah. And yeah, that was incredible. A uh, two point field goal. He's just he was, the fucking. He's a absolute he's gun, so Cleary. He was he's a so little good. He was a little rusty in the first half, uh, but yeah, no, you got it done in the second half. Too easy. Yep. Um, did you take the Titans as well? I took the Titans. Oh, Sad. No, yeah, no, that's probably. I don't think we're going to win the grand final, bro. I d- oh yeah, <laughs> oh shaky ground. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna make the finals. We really needed to beat uh, Manly. That was yeah. one of the ones in my calculations that was an easy win. Uh, easy win. <laughs> Manly humming. Uh, what can you say? What can you do? Yeah. Um, do we think Manly are gonna make the grand final? I think based on that performance, like beating the Titans, I think they're going to win the next three premierships. I think you okay. can basically guarantee that. Like, if they're going to beat such a quality outfit like the Titans, I th- there's something special. Yeah. Sucks for Des and Foz. Once in a generation team, that one. We'll get them next time. Uh, all right. And the last game was Doys, uh, Dogs. I took the Dogs. Did you take the Doys? No, you took the Dogs. I had the Dogs as well. Awful. Yeah. A very, very strong week. To the, for tipping for me and then fell apart yeah. in the end yeah gross falls apart about halfway through yeah uh, mm. oh we're gonna do axel got a perfect round so now i am clearly at the bottom uh i don't think i'm gonna win the tipping comp this year i think i'm on shaky no. ground as well <laughs> i think that's yeah a real possibility for me yeah all right that was it anything to say about these games the week that was nah fuck them let's move on fuck them all right you want to tip Yes. Yeah, we could tip. Um, Waz Tigers. Tigers paying $4. Uh, Waz have got Roger Tuovasa Shek at fullback. I don't think he was there last week, was he? Mm, was no, that Tua Picky must have gotten injured or dropped? Tain's, Tain's got a head knock, so oh, RTS okay. is going there. Spewing. Uh, let me have a look. Uh, Lachlan Galvin is moving to six, unless he's been there the whole time. And Latu Fainu is coming in at seven. No, Caesar played seven. Uh, Caesar's out suspended. Uh, let me see. Look, man, it wouldn't surprise me if the Tigers get a win here. The Waz are more or less like Q and the Rack stuff, I feel like. Um, they're not going to get make the eight. They probably know they're not going to make the eight, and they're very sad about it. Um, is this Benjamin? Yeah, it's Ben. Is he knocking? He's knocking. I'll give him the link. Yeah, give him the link. Um, I can just sort of filibuster while we talk about the first game here. <laughs> the Waz are underdone. It wouldn't surprise me if the Tigers come out and just, you know, season's over. Fuck yeah. Let's put these guys in the dirt with us. What do mm. you think? I think Warriors, they scored more tries than the Raiders last week and lost on goal kicking. Mm. Um, and they're at home here. Mm-hmm. RTS at fullback. With, you could arguably say he should be there the whole time. Oh, is, yeah. is he here? Is he here? Hey, say something for us, Ben. Why the fuck didn't you send me the link? <laughs> I didn't think it'd show up. Yeah. You sent a link in a private chat. That's the most disrespectful thing I've ever heard. No, we, I, I don't ever send a link to Mike. Mike's, Mike's. Like, as soon as I start the meeting, he gets a notification because he's logged into Teams. Yeah. And I've got to ask for a link now. The guy yeah. that made, the, that invented this shit is now asking for a link. Yeah. That's right. Uh, what's up with the necklace? Oh, yeah, you, I wear a necklace now. Why are you a Greek daddy? you got your necklace on the outside of the mm. shirt. I've got some some George Spiration. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. So um, I don't even... Wh- I don't even fucking... I've never seen George's uh, jewellery box, but I'm sure there's a gold fucking pendant in it somewhere. He's not much of a jewellery guy, my dad. No, he he's have more a gold about, pendant. He, he's, he, he's more about... Um, he'll wear a watch, I think. But apart from that, he's more about like um, very like bougie, uh, overly designed jeans and oh, yeah. white polos, you know, mm-hmm. that sort of thing. Loves a polo. He's getting, he's getting whatever, whatever the tightest size is minus a size. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Always. <laughs> and he's Stuart getting, little size. If you're he's yeah, Stuart, getting Stuart size. the most expensive polo at the best special day of the year. 
<laughs> yeah. And that's um, your dad. Ben, yeah. Ben, what are you, what are your um, thoughts on a, on Stuart Little? Mm. Oh, the movie, dude. Yeah. <laughs> would it be would the it cinematic actually, universe? I, I saw yeah. about half of it recently. Okay. Thoughts? Yeah. Which half? The first half. That's how you watch a movie from beginning to end. No, maybe you walked on... in on. Maybe you walked in on someone watching it. No, no. <laughs> I I curated I curated the selection that time. Oh, you couldn't have done a very good job if you watched the first half. Well, that's how long a lesson is. Oh, okay. <laughs> As a teacher, that's how long a lesson is. Half of Stuart Little. Like, Mr. Yeah. Ben, we ever going to watch the second half of Stuart Little? No, only <laughs> yeah. first halves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, it was it was like the last or second last day of the year. It was a burner day, mm-hmm. day you know. Didn't yeah. Happen. Okay. Anyway, welcome to Just the Tip, everybody that's just joining us right now. Um, I'm your host, Ben. Uh, mm-hmm. Along with us, we have... Mike, our trusted uh, spinneriffer, and on the other side we have our uh, resident Benedict Arnold. Um, That's me. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you know me. That's I'm it. the greatest betrayer there is. Um, <laughs> I will. I will be tipping the yeah. Warriors in this game. <laughs> um, Seems like the smart choice. Yeah. Uh, Tigers losing four in a row. Um, Wilds have a six-game winning streak against the Tigers. They're back home. They should beat the Tigers. The Tigers are getting the wooden spoon. That should be fine. Uh, Benjamin? Uh, I'm on Wahboy. Wahboy and Wahtown? So, Matt, basically, I've been working on this formula, right? Yep. And yeah, I'm, not gonna go, I'm not going to go into it, but I've got, I've got notes that I've, I've written, and basically, yeah. like, it's a whole widgemadu, but I, I've uh-huh. got some formulas I've made and stuff, and... Okay. I'm going to, I got to run the numbers okay. tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. So As I said to you tips, before. All, all my tips tonight are tentative and penciled in because I haven't run my system. So I got to yeah. want to test the system this week. I want to see, I'll, I want to see it tested for the rest of this, of the year, not just this yeah. week. I want to so see a good sample size. Yeah. yeah. I want to see a but sample actually, size. I genuinely believe that once I explain the logic of it, you'll be like, that's fucking good. Mm-hmm. So we'll okay. see if it works in practice. Okay. Once you know what the logic is to it, let us know, and we'll let you know whether or not it's good. There's no 100 percent betting strategy unless mm-hmm. you are. Uh, who was the who was the football player that walked on water? Let us know in the Je- comments. Jesus. Jesus, I think it was Kevin Hastings. Um, someone. <laughs> Do you know what he's talking about? No. Um, no, I, I think, see, all, I I think know we're all taking the Warriors. Before your era, boys. You guys are the 2018 <laughs> okay. boom. I was there back in the old Twas, the Nas. <laughs> Twas, the Nas. Okay, Kevin, Hay- Kevin Hastings walked on water. All right, jot There's that no down. There's no in the comments. Yeah. Kevin Hastings, if you know who he is and what can uh, History on who he is. Uh, next game we have... Next game, we have got uh, the Parramatta Eels versus the Melbourne Storm. Uh, let's see. Mitchell Moses out with, I assume, the bicep injury for the rest yeah. of the season. Dejan Arce is not the same as that. Um, more or less 1-17. to 17. Other than that, let me look. Who's there? Brendan Hands is still in their hooker position. Looking over. Ryan Pappenhausen is getting, like, dick loads of an injections per week into some body part. I can't remember. Is it his foot? Mm. Is his ankle? His knee? Yeah, can't remember. Like, but he's cooked. He shouldn't be playing for the rest of the season. He's fucking cooked. They don't need him. He just put Wishy back there. It'll be fine. Or Nick Nick Meany or something. Hmm. Um, yeah, they'll be sweet for the rest of the season. He's Pappy. the biggest waste. How how much? How many millions of dollars have Melbourne wasted on that man with the the time he hasn't played? Definitely, Probably definitely at least like more. a couple million. Not more than Souths have wasted on Latrell, I would say. I feel like Pappy's not on a million, I don't think. I would say no. Pappy's probably on like 750, 800K. And I can probably yeah. check that if you, um, I, if you want. I'm, I'll call him. I'll ask. Call him up. Yeah. Call yeah. up uh, Frank, uh, Frank Panisi. Uh, hey. yeah, 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 yeah. Good. How are you, man? Hey, quick question just on the show. Um, how much do you get paid? Mm. Oh, really? Oh, that little? Okay, he's right. Yeah, no, seven seven eighty or something. You're right. Okay. I'm sorry, I fucked that up. I thought it was higher. Uh, Ryan Pappenhausen, excuse me. Yeah, eight hundred k. I was right. Like you said on the phone call, mm-hmm. I was right. Pretty good. Uh, seven eighty. 
Can you think of any reason, Matt, to tip the Eels this week? I can think of a reason, but it's not a good reason. Uh, and therefore, I'm, I'm going to disregard it. Okay. Um, yeah, no, there's there's no good reason to tip the Parramatta here. Obviously, Moses is gone. They are bottom of the barrel. They're in a hole. Storm, top of the ladder, flying. Mm-hmm. I know Para had a decent record against Melbourne a few years ago, but... Storm have won the last three against them. Storm should win and win well. I'll say 16 points. Yeah. What do you think about Blaise Delonghi being promised the number one fullback jersey next year? And... Um, that nothing is set in stone. You can't promise yeah. anyone anything. They, That's I mean, true. they promised Josh Schuster a back row spot at Manly this year, didn't they? <laughs> Yikes. Remember that? Yeah, no, yeah I remember <laughs> that. Uh, that wasn't a promise. That was more of a... You're going back. You're being told. So it was a hint. You, you can get told again. Now we're going. Ben. Eel Storm. Storm. Go. Ugh. I'm also going to take the Storm. Eel suck, yep. Dick. Uh, next game, we've got the Broncos versus the Dogs. Saturday, 3 p.m. game. And what are you looking at, Ben? You mean what am I looking at? Well, you got your phone like here. I'm not, the one talk- I'm not the one talking. Yeah, Where but you're, you're, you're on the you're on the show. All right. <laughs> no, I just want to know. No, I'm, not, I'm not saying don't. I just want to know what you're doing. Yeah. Share was, with us. It's uh, nothing. It's work. <laughs> it's not work. I feel it like was. It's, it was. It was. Cro- crooked. I, I, I sorry. Cro- I just need to check. Crooked what time I'm Starting tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. That's all. I gotta check. You talk amongst yourselves for like thirty seconds, and then. Let don't let me hold time. you up. No, it's fine. You can, yeah, no, pa- apparently good. you don't need me to start a show anyway. So we don't. You you said to start without you. Yeah, Fuck, that's so he's, early. Ben is. It's, oh my god! He, do you need to go? He's butthurt of his own decisions. <laughs> All right. He deleted ten thousand emails, ten thousand texts. You know. All right. It's, they're gone. Done. No more phone. Let's go. He's always anyway, asking people about their win? finances. Matt, who are you yeah. tipping? Uh, B- Broncos Bulldogs. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, man, you guys are making this diff. I'm gonna have to fucking edit the shit out of this one. Oh yeah. Um, uh, Broncos Why? Bulldogs. You. This is this is this is the it's problem. The edit things out. What? What? Save yourself work and don't edit anything. Well, the last couple of weeks when his computer's been broken, he hasn't edited anything out. So that's right. That's right. Yeah. Oh, really? that's yeah. A yeah, <laughs> huge problem. Huge problem. Anyways, we're, anyways, we're, we're back on track now. Uh, Broncos yes. and Bulldogs. Brisbane mm-hmm. breaking their losing streak last mm-hmm. week, and they they needed that. Reynolds yeah. back. All their boys about Cobo's back this week, but they are missing Piakura. I think he's got a groin issue, a uh, groin issue of some sort. I think he's in the reserves. Um, Bulldogs here, basically the same side uh, as last Why week. Why do you keep saying groin? Cowboys. Why don't you just say what it is? Cock. Just cock say the injury. word. Just call I it don't a think, cock injury, I, I just don't think it is a cock injury. Oh. I think it's a groin injury. <laughs> is that like the hip? It's no, like the, the it's like is, the area where your yeah, legs meet. And, and that includes groin. the cocks. The the cock is included in the groin. The groin is like the general region. So the groin by nature, like cock is a sub element of the groin. I yeah. think we just, I just, it makes me uncomfortable in the comments. Cock when you miss your words like that, Matt. Just call it a cock injury, please. I think um, not all cock injuries, no, not all groin injuries are cock injuries, but yeah. all cock injuries are groin injuries. Okay. Yes. 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 Correct. And okay. So is that based, co- based yeah, on that co- logic, sorry. Yeah. based on that logic, um, I will be tipping the Broncos in this game. Back at mm-hmm. home, troops turning. I think the Broncos forwards are going to get the edge. They're going to come over the top of the dogs here who are missing Max King still. I'll say Broncos win six points. Yeah, groin I 100% tip. agree. <laughs> that is a groin tip. Um, and you don't want a groin flip. Uh, yeah, I 100% agree, I think. It's going to be I an absolutely flipped. tight one, and uh, the dogs forwards are going to get rolled over. Um, I, I tip the dogs, and just the spines. Just and you know me, swapped. I I look at it when I'm not sure, I look at a team's spine and I just sort of see which one is better. Um, and the Broncos' spine is back. Uh, so I assume they are going to be the ones that take the win. Benjamin, Broncos, Bulldogs. 
Dad, I want to tip the dogs. You going to tip dogs? the dogs? I did. I've been on the dogs. Um, I changed to the Broncos today, but I got to run the numbers. Got to run the numbers. Run the numbers. Pencil in Broncos. Yeah, sounds okay. good. Why are you talking to a microphone that's not plugged in? Yeah, good point. <laughs> Why are you wearing a a hood? Because I'm unwell. He's sick. He's sick. sick. Oh, did if I you, miss that? If you ever showed up on time, you would have known that. Yeah, he's sick. He still showed up on time as well, and he's sick. Did you go to work today? Yeah. No. Do you still get paid? Yeah. Do you deserve to still get paid? Yeah. Have you told anyone at work what you do tonight? Yeah. They do know? Yeah. You're an idiot. Don't tell yeah. soul. No. Don't tell. This is private gentleman's discussion of excellence. What happens between the three of us stays between the three of us. Potentially the episode put, title. Uh, the next game we've online, got is the so Cowboys versus the Sharks. Cowboys come off of a famous win against the Dogs last weekend. Um, Chad Towson looks hot. Uh, but Sharks, they come off the bye. Uh, mm-hmm. Nico Hines is out for the season. Can you remind me what happened to him? Um, he did... Cock injury. No, I don't think it was cock. I think it was something to do with his ankle, maybe? Balls. Or his foot, broken foot. I can't remember. Beard injury. Maybe oh, his wait, knee? he doesn't really have a beard. Can't remember. But he's. I think he's coming back just before finals. Yeah. I think that... The Doys looked really good last weekend, and I feel like the week to have the Origin players rested again, I think they're going to be even hotter. I think they're going to get on a roll, and they're going to make the finals. Uh, mm. They're going to take the Titan spot in the finals. Sharks are still going to make the finals, but they're only just. I am going to take the Doys here, Benjamin. Who have you got? Oh, I'm yeah. not even. Gonna, I don't. E- I don't even. I'm not going to choose because yeah. this one I've got a quant. I've got to run the numbers. Okay. Matt, who have you got in the Cowboys Sharks? Thank you for attending, <laughs> Benjamin. Uh, this tipping podcast. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll pencil in. Um, he always does. He always sharks. says he's not pencil going to sharks. tip, and then does. Yeah. Okay. Pencil that in, Matt. So, okay. Pencil in. The sharks beat him last time. I'm pretty sure up in um, yeah. North Queensland. Up in shit holesville. Yeah. Um, Cowboys in Sharks. Holesville, yeah. In Townsville. As you said, Cowboys, good win over the Dogs. Looked pretty good. Holmes goes to the wing this week. Mm -hmm. I'm sure he's happy with that. Perju center. As you said, Cronulla coming off the bye, but no Nico Hines still. And also now no Will Kennedy suspended. So they've got a fellow called Liam Eisen debuting at fullback. His teammates call him Ice, which I think bodes very well for him. Mm. I did see a picture of this kid and he does not look cool. Like, oh really? You know, sometimes when you see a picture of a player and you're like, "That's not a winning. That's not. That doesn't look like a winner's. <laughs> doesn't look. Does, doesn't he's doesn't got look a real like a Brent Naden face about him, does uh-huh. he? Yeah, like I get the same. <laughs> it, he doesn't. He doesn't look like this player, but like I'm getting like Isaac Lumi Lumi vibes off him. Like he doesn't just instill me with confidence. Is it this child? Liam Eisen, yeah. Who's Liam the Eisen. guy? Who's Newtown. The guy yeah, there in he is. Melbourne. Who's the guy in Melbourne with the fake chin? The fake chin. Oh, you, Alec McDonald. Know. Alec he's McDonald. Coming. Yeah, yeah. He lo- he looks like he's got a head made out of um like Play Doh. Like he's a, <laughs> like a, he's like a Wallace and Gromit character. <laughs> um, uh, but yeah, I'm also leaning towards the home side, the Cowboys. I think yeah, Origin players maybe in form. Sharks, shaky ground, replacement players. Cows have also been a few top teams. They've beaten. I yeah. think. The Roosters, they beat the Penrith. So. Cows don't deal well with expectation, though. I feel like they're just before that expectation point. No, though. look at the numbers. They're 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 running in favourites, um, even with sporties. Mm, okay. Well, I'm going to take the cows for now, but I'll run my states. I'll run my stats on it. But here's why. Notes. Here's why you can't you can't take this prices on sports bet as the yeah. actual odds because those prices fluctuate on supply and demand with them. So if everybody's betting the Cowboys, the Cowboys, like it's it's supply and demand, not just what their quants have done. See, mm-hmm. what my formula does is remove that. My The prices aren't involved in my formula at all. Keep selling, keep selling. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's because we're gonna we're, we're gonna launch Eight. Benny's Benny's tipping formula. <laughs> you're gonna get you're gonna get at least a For... month free. You're gonna get a month's free trial of the formula. Yeah. Hell yeah. How much is it after that? How much I don't is it per know. month? Fifty nine ninety nine um, per month. Do you think? Yeah. How, if, if you, you could, could get a hundred uh, people to all right, subscribe, I'm promising on the show right now. For the first month, it'll be uh-huh. less than fifty nine ninety five. Okay. Okay. Nine ninety nine. Um, Free first right. week. Yeah. So we're all on the doys. Oh, you penciled no. in sharks. Ben's right. on the sharks. All right. Next game, we have got the chocobos who went down to the storm. Ben. Mm. The storm beat the roosters last weekend. You had you had to go there, didn't you? <laughs> I mean, it's it. What are you looking hey, at? What's up, dude? It's Ryan. Hey. Hey, sorry, I'm I'm just on a uh, on that pod that computer thingy I do. Is that, yeah, is that, is that computer a thingy? A pod computer yeah. thingy. Can't see. Who is that? Ah, uh, it's a cousin. It was your host? Oh, is that cousin Michael? A cousin. A cousin. You've only. Got I didn't one say cousin. he's my cousin. I said cousin a cousin Michael. of somebody. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to cousin Michael. He's probably the most normal member of your family. <laughs> why? Why? Why doesn't he, he tell us? He doesn't even his cousin's first why name. Why does he even answer it? Why is he so secretive about, about Michael? Yeah. <laughs> why are you so secretive about your family on the internet? That's why we're asking you. Yeah, no, right. We're not doing a bit. We're asking you. Anyways. Um, Anyways. Yeah, r- Roosters. Roosters. My whole yeah. presence is a bit, dude. <laughs> no, it's not. It's really... My life is a bit. <laughs> oh yeah, that part is true. <laughs> yeah. It's it's a bit within a bit. I've got bits and bits within bits. Yeah. You've gone so, so method. You've gone so method that you are that character now. Yeah, bits within bits. Episode title. Right that one now. Probably it. not. Uh... No. <laughs> no. I'm just gonna jot that down on my invisible typewriter. I think yeah. the funny scale. I think. I think like. I mean, God knows how many people have left before they knew I was coming on. But, yeah. like, the scoreboard is, like, Ben, eight laughs. Matt, like, two laughs. Mike, two laughs. <laughs> mm. Okay. Okay. Let's, let's comment. Let's... Anyone who's watched the entire episode up until this point, yeah. give us the laugh tally. Yeah, yeah. please. So far. No, you should you have the laugh tally. Oh, no, like, we on. can't put numbers on it, Matt. Come on now. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. You can't yeah, put yeah, that. Yeah, we'll put numbers on it. What are we going to do? Who's then we'll have some, let's get a bit of quant. The quant. Yeah. Who's funny? Who's going to be able to quantify it? Then no one's going to put a fucking number on it. You won't let him. Yeah. You you just said, here are the numbers. like a six and a half funny. Normally. Oh, he's gone from a he's gone from an eight to a six and a half. Across the board funny. Across the board. No, no, you're, the hey, okay. Matt, you no, I'm sorry, Mike, you're like a seven point one across the board funny. Some Matt, funny you're like you. a Matt's like a five point six five across Jesus. the board funny. And I'm like a nine. I feel like maybe you just don't understand my my humor. Yeah, it's maybe true. it's not the for problem, you. Well, the problem is that it's like this is borderline it's another rudimentary. therapy session. Your, your, your humor is rudimentary at best. Mm-hmm. Rudimentary. Your humor. Your your humor is uh, the ball of the toy world. Interesting. Like, what, do I just do like knock knock jokes? Is that what I do? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You're like, oh, watch me juggle, guys. Uh oh, I dropped the balls. Yeah. Okay, so if I'm the ball of comedy. What's mm-hmm. what, how would you describe your um, comedy, Ben? I'm like, like, eight hundred dollar Lego set. Nah, I feel I feel well, like no. you're you're like, like the you're, a... you're the vomit inside of the 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 the, the, the tubes. You know, like those uh, playgrounds at McDonald's, you can like crawl through them. You're the vomit <laughs> that's been left inside of there, and they can't get out. I was gonna say it was like a sad. You're the guy that cleans party. the vomit. <laughs> I'm the ball. <laughs> You've already told me. <laughs> no, Anyways. you vomit. Okay. Um, you this, vomit. this, yeah. Roosters this is, manly should be when, a good one. When someone scrolls their mouse over the uh, the chapters in this video, um, there's this is going to say roosters seagulls. This section. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Suck a dick. Who specifically? 
Oh, uh, no, I mean, whoever's actually still here watching us. Yeah, okay. Yeah, if, um, if, if you're looking for quality tips, go check out Rugby League History. Oh, I yeah. got the best idea. I got the or best wobbling. idea. So this is what we're going to do. Just we're now gonna, or Everybody like needs earlier? to comment. If you watch this bit, we need a code word, right? So it's like, find the code word. The code word is Petro Seven Receiver. So if you're watching this right now, type that in the comments, and then we know you're actually watching. That's code word, Petro Seven Receiver. Yep. Nah. I don't know how to spell his last name, but yeah. Uh, And um, the first person to comment Petro Seven Receiver gets six months free of Ben's tipping formula. That's a good deal. You heard it here first, folks. (laughs) Uh, I think out of spite, I'm just going to take Manly. Uh, they are sort of humming, and they did beat the um, the potential premiers in the Titans last weekend. Uh, so I am going to take Manly. Matt? Really tricky game to tip. There's a couple this week. This is one of them. Sydney, as has been reported in the news this week, uh, very poor record against the current top eight teams this year. And also have a one in 20, one out of 20 record against the Storm and the Panthers. The last 20 games against those two teams, one win. Come on, why really? do we need to? There's a million stats, and that's a stat you want to give. Well, it's on, a, any, it's, on any team in any point in time, it, that's the stat you want to give. <laughs> there are real questions about whether this Roosters team are flat track bullies How and they can't step up to the good teams. Your head in your life? <laughs> okay, well, this game at the end of the day is about wins and losses, and the Roosters can't beat good teams at the moment. Uh, Manly, three game winning streak. Uh, Tom Trebojevic looking very dangerous at fullback. Uh, a few changes, Lee Hopawade getting that eye socket injury as I swelled up in that game yeah. against the Titans. Um, both teams, by the way, very good attacking teams. Both teams can score points. I can see a few points flowing in this game. I'm going to say... It's in a lot of penalties, a lot of drop balls. I'm going to say that the Roosters answer their critics and they... Tough out a tight win. I say Roosters win by four. Okay, interesting. Uh, Benjamin, who, <laughs> Benjamin, who have you got? The red, white, and blue will triumph over the Travoy of I. Both uh, five eights are named Luke. I think that's a fun stat. That's also that's a fun stat. Big a problem. Fun stat. Uh, huge problem. Uh, so you got the red, white, and blue, obviously. Very good. Um, uh, next game, we've got the Dragons versus the Panth. Uh, we're going to stick to our guns here and never not tip a team that's the not the Panthers. Uh, Luai's back. Toto's back. Yo is back. Uh, this Dylan, be a quick one for sure. Dylan Edwards uh, is still injured, but that's fine. He should be back later. Um, not even going to bother looking at the Dragons team. Uh, Benjamin, who you got for this one? Cat. Pant? Cats. Cat. Okay. Are there multiple cats in the comp, or is there just one kitty cat? Tigers. Oh, yeah, tigers, yeah. So I am right to be confused by that answer. Uh, Matt, mm-hmm. who have you got for this one? Well, I'm obviously going to tip the Panthers. That's mm. obviously going to happen. Uh, Cleary's back, big performance incoming, all the big guns. I know the Dragons beat Penrith earlier this year. I think that was just before Origin. I was going to say explain in detail, but I knew you would anyway. Yeah, well, you know, this is um, just what we need to do uh, on this podcast. I mean, I... I Great I, joke, Bird. Actually, I tell you what, would you like me to that tip like fun. you for the that rest of me. the... Would you like me to tip like you for the rest of the do episode? It. Do it. Do it. Yes, All right, I'm gonna I do, I'm gonna, Did we shout I'm, out to Axel on this? Did we give Axel a shout okay. out? Yes, we did. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to tip like Ben for the rest of the episode. Please. Uh, I, this is our margin game. Um, I'm going to take her by seven. Um, I smile. Wait, wait, wait. Boy, <laughs> I love it. I love it. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on a wait. second. I've just had the best idea. Uh, I just had the best idea. Hold on. Yeah, hold on. Everybody, stop. I've lost Stuart my Stuart Little Cinematic oh, Universe. Oh, <laughs> okay, yeah. and we charge what? people. <laughs> uh, Panth. Is he? He's got some security. Security knocking at the door. I think security's knocking. <laughs> Shit. Uh, next game, we've got the uh, Dolphin versus the Titans. Uh, let me have a look at these teams. Yeah, Titans more or less 1-13, to 13, sure? right? Or 1-17, to 17, rather. Uh, no one's really out, right? No, nah, no one's really out. People are only in. Same with uh, the Dolphins. Hammer carved. Hey, 
up uh, uh, in the first half. Um, potentially even going to pick him up in my fantasy team, the old Hamasai Tabu Ifido. Mm. Um, yeah, I think like Dolphins really for this one. Dolphins get it done, get it done well, secure their spot in the top eight potentially. Um, mm. Ben one, who have you got for this one? And he's got to go kick out a tenant that's like. No, I said Ben call one. The police. Ben one. Is that me? Yeah, that's you. How did he um, get one? Um, <laughs> I want to be left. Ben one A. He's Ben one B. No. So I'm B, Ben. B, B, um, You're Ben oh, one. Yeah. What 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 game are we tipping? Uh, this is the <laughs> Dolphins Titans. All right, I'm gonna be Matt. I'm gonna be. Um, Matt. If you're gonna be do- Ben. I'm gonna be Matt. Okay. Um. Okay. Wait. Oh, wait. Hold on a second. Uh, yeah, what's up? Ben. No, no, no. Matt doesn't interrupt people. You Hang tip. on. Sit, sit back. Anyway, Mike. Yeah, yeah. Matt's, Ben's just going to keep doing this. Who, who have you got? Yeah, I don't know. I just got caught. <laughs> you can't do a bit of a guy that's not on here. I don't know. Wait, could you just give me a second? Yeah. Don't Sorry. wait for him. Don't don't indulge this. Don't you sycophantic. Cunt. Well, just take don't, the cheese don't out. Don't indulge this. <laughs> Use a Q-tip. The longer you wait for okay. Matt to keep doing his bit, the more right. <laughs> you take him down okay. the throat. The deeper love you too. he goes, I love you soon. What does that mean? Can we wrap this up, please? <laughs> yeah, you can't place it. Who was that? Was that your cousin? I was until you took the phone um, call, Ben. Anyway. That's not what, that's, our... that was just, that was work. Don't worry about it. All right. Yeah. Let's talk Last about shot. the next game. Coming in. Hold on. Let me just bring this open. Next yeah, game, dolphins. we have the Dolphins. Versus the who they're versing. Is this is this your Matt Titans. impression? Titans. Oh yeah. my god. That doesn't oh, usually yeah. do that. You sort of you get you're getting mixed. Yeah, you it's just, actually you, left. <laughs> is this what Matt does? Uh, yeah. Let's just power through it, dude. I'm done. Uh, <laughs> okay. Next game we've got um, the yeah. I'm, I'm tipping I'm tipping the Dolphins by the way. Dolphins, yeah. Uh, next game, ty- uh, Raiders Rabbitoh is actually pretty interested to see what you have to say about this. Um, yeah, fuck. Look at these teams. Let me look at these spines, actually. Jamal Fogarty was pretty good for the Raiders on the weekend, I thought. Um, Tommy Starling, Levi. Um, fuck, fuck. This one's a hard one. Who who have you got for this one? I'll take Sorry, whatever am, you got. Am I Ben or Matt? No, you're back to Matt. I'm back to Matt? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, tough game to tip. You know, Raiders got the win despite scoring less points last year. Fogarty mm. really improving that side getting back yeah. in there, basically doing 99% of all in-play kicking, which is crazy. You'd love to see um, it. Rabbitohs, still a chance for finals, although it's probably unlikely. Uh, desperately need a win here. Still no Latrell, still no Cameron Murray. Those are some big outs for them at the moment. Um, yeah. They've got a little bit of a shift in the back line. Center, cheek ham, host comes in the back row. Um, mm. Raiders, a chance to go two from two at home, and they've not been fantastic at home this year. I'll say... They hold off the bunnies. Oh, Ben, you're doing well now. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I've been, I've been Matt. Because um, Matt hasn't been here. I've been filling in for Matt. Um, <laughs> uh, so if I was Matt. <laughs> that was a seven and a half. That was thank you. If I was Matt, I would tip the Raiders by four points. Uh, but Fuck I'm Ben. Yeah. So I'm going to say Green Boys. Green Boys. <laughs> cool. All right. Uh, ben, Raiders, uh, Rabbits. I've, I've got Red Boys. Cool. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Ron, Green Boy. Green Boy. Yeah, solid green boys. Uh, all right. First comment we've got here is from, uh, and I'm so proud of you in the comments this week, Matt. I'm going to save it for last. Mm-hmm. Uh, in response to the hypothetical, uh, rugby league history would not partake. He likes his teeth and you don't want false ones neither. Okay, good to know. Thank you. Cool. Uh, Harry writes, this is where I come for my House of the Dragon spoilers. Yep. Sorry. My bad. <laughs> you my watch bad. yourself. My bad. Um, Mr. Cunningham. Good to hear from you, Mr. Cunningham, as always. Um, imagine you three are cellmates on cell block B. Uh, which of you would have your pipes cleaned out, which I think is uh, rape? Uh, which of you would partake in a plastic fork to the gut? And which of you would be accepted as the leader of a prominent gang? What did you say? You respond to these. Yeah, gang leader, Michael, Matt. Yeah, I think probably you would be the gang leader. I'm probably going to take the fork to the gut. And I think Ben's likely to get his pipes cleaned out. Next comment we have got is uh, Epic Armadillo writes, Sharks beat Storm at Melbourne, so Roosters should be able to do it as well. 
And I'm going to the Titans game this week, so I can't wait to see the Titans win and kick the Seagulls out of the top eight. Neither of those things happened. Yeah. And he probably never went right. to the game too, dude. Yeah. Nah. Um, <laughs> missed it. Missed it. Um, all right. What? Now, this is the P... P- what do they call it? The pièce de résistance. Pièce de résistance. I'm just going to quickly go through this um, this comment chain real quick. Yeah. Um, William Pearson writes, "Storm will win." Uh, to which I assume Matt responds with, "Incorrect." Uh, William Pearson comes back. He says, "Storm are the first on the ladder for a reason," <laughs> and you respond, "They cheated." <laughs> and then he writes, "He writes, we don't cheat anymore." And then you respond, Roosters will win by 18 points. And he comes back. He says, no, they won't. So you go back again, uh, 19 points. And he's just going back and forth at this point. He yeah. says, no. And you give him a break. You lay off him at this point. Future Body Tech comes in here with the angel numbers, says, Chooks, 66 to 6. And William Pearson tells Future Body Tech to shut up. <laughs> and now, And now here I come. Uh, I believe a full 48 hours after the game and after the storm had won and wrote Roosters 13 plus. (laughs) 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 And he comes back to me. He says, Roosters lost to the storm 24 to eight. So I need someone else to go in there and tell him something along the lines of there's always time. There's still time. The Roosters are always in a, in a rugby league game. Please just troll this motherfucker. Always in a game. All right, let let me get in there right now. (laughs) I'll, 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 I'll let him know about it. Let's see. Let's see. Replies. Um, shut up. Show more replies. Roosters lost to the storm. I said, games. Fuck you. Shut still up. Still going, bro. <laughs> uh, yeah. Get love that. Bloody... Comment, comment thread of can the we, year. Can we for ban? Sure. Can we? Actually, no, we shouldn't ban Why? him. He's a we good shouldn't dude, ban him. No. He's our, only, he's our only viewer. It's engagement. We've just That's milked right. him. It is. It is. We milked him like a like a good glory hole like, for like, for content. Like a goat. Yeah, like, just like a like a like a, like a, like a, the a old ju- family goat. Yeah, a juicy uh, cow on the spectrum. Do one of you guys have a hypothetical for this week? Matt ben? does. Matt? No. Okay. Would you like which, me to whip one? Which up? Ben? Yeah. Oh, uh, let's both whip one up. Okay. Um, here's here, here's one. How about this? We do a, like a word chain. I'll say wood, and then you go. We make one together. Would you rather have a centaur on your face, or have a minotaur under your Mike, finish it. Um, mother's <laughs> left. Um, vaginal lip. Full stop. Full so, stop. Yeah. Full stop. All right. So, Matt, Mike, can you read that one out? Uh, would I rather have a centaur on my face, <laughs> yep. or a minotaur under my mother's left vaginal? Lip. lip shout out to my yeah. mum who watches these yeah uh, let's 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 break this down yeah. uh, you know what i'm gonna be a I'm good gonna, son i'm gonna, gonna, I'm gonna take the centaur, the centaur on the face yeah. just to help yeah. my mum i don't know what my mum would do with a minotaur she'd probably be scared i don't want to think of any other options um just <laughs> hopefully fear mm. <laughs> i think the question is are these minotaurs and are these centaurs friendly or are they wild because that's going to oh, change my beast. answer have to, I mean, a centaur is not inherently a wild beast, but I feel like a minotaur is an unruly creature. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Good question. I mean, as we know, minotaurs um, have an innate ability to um, navigate labyrinths and mazes, mm. and perhaps mm-hmm. that makes them good at finding the clitoris. Maybe. So I'm gonna I'm gonna send this minotaur underneath my mother's left vaginal flap, and I'll <laughs> let him go to town. Give her a good time. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, that episode is just a tip. I think, I think that's it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do a thumb. Let's do a thumb. Thumbie, we need to do a thumbnail. Yeah, thumb, yeah, thumb, 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 thumb. No, 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 thumb. Oh, we're not finished? Thumb. thumb. I, I love that energy. Hold that energy. Um, it's thumb time. I just popped yeah. a shoulder. I popped a peck, dude. 
Oh. You ready? You ready to do a thumb? And no, Ben, just stay, just stay right in the middle. Yes, yeah, right in the middle. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> yeah. All right, we got something out of that for sure. I'll do. All right, hit it. Uh, I lost it. Thank you, Rich. lost it. I gave all of it in one. I just shot my load everywhere. Yeah. You're asking me to, to regen to the quick. quick. Um, First in line at the orgy, brother. Come on. Ooh, it's second win. Just, oh, you, you've come twice without, like, losing it, right? Without the regen before? Surely. Not since my 20s. Well, it's the only thing we're trying to do. Tip Matt has been Matt, Mike has been Mike, I've been myself. Go fuck yourself. I hope you've been yourself. Don't take advice from anybody, take advice from everybody. And always drive with your eyes open. Follow your nose. Follow your nose. <laughs>、wait, wait, 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 hold wait, on a wait. second. I've just had the best idea. Uh, I just had the best idea. Hold on. Yeah, hold on. Everybody stop. I've lost Stuart my Stuart Little Cinematic oh, Universe. <laughs>